They've watched their dogs get sick. Some have seen their beloved pets die. Thousands of North American owners suspect food treats from China caused the illnesses. But those treats have undergone extensive testing by the U.S. government, and so far there's no definitive link. And some stores have chosen to keep selling them. As Kathleen Tomlinson reports, that has left some dog owners outraged. Look, there's a hole in it. Alda Wersch says her grandchildren yeah. keep asking, where's Rosie? They felt so comfortable with her. They just loved her too. The tiny Yorkshire Terrier was just a year old, healthy until Wersch bought Vitalife duck tenders made in China at Costco. She gave them to the puppy every day for three weeks. Her kidneys shut down. These killed my dog, so there's something in them that is killing, that's poisoning the dogs. She was suffering in pain and I was there holding her in my arms when she died. Her vet believes the treats must have been toxic. She's convinced there's no other explanation for how Rosie died. The proof is in the science. Like we're now seeing more and more cases like that, like more and more proof is coming out. 1,000 cases have been reported to the FDA in the U.S. since 2007. Dogs that died after eating various brands of duck, sweet potato or chicken jerky treats made in China. The Centers for Disease Control is investigating. Despite exhaustive FDA testing, the link remains a mystery. Some stores here are pulling them anyway. Wersch told Costco how Rosie died. It told her the treats are safety tested, so there's no problem. There's no way that Costco can test for something when they don't know why the dogs are dying from these treats. Even the FDA doesn't know why they're dying. We found them at Costco, Walmart and Superstore. The label on the small bags gives no indication they're made in China. This seal says Canada quality. I nearly killed my dog. Lynn Ross's dog got very sick after eating a different brand of Chinese-made treats. Costco stopped selling them. She can't understand why it would risk more problems. If I were Costco, I would just take all of these treats off the shelves. It's not worth it. Costco didn't answer our numerous calls. The company that imports Vitalife products told us it can't understand how Rosie's vet can link them to her death. It says the products are tested in China and in an approved Canadian lab. The government doesn't regulate pet food within Canada and the Veterinary Medical Association says it's lobbied to stop imports of all pet treats made in China with no success. Kathy Tomlinson, CBC News, Vancouver. If you have a story you want Kathy and the Go Public team to follow, you can get in touch with her by email. Just head to cbcnews.ca slash gopublic.